We are, uh, have been for some years now been moving out into the world to be, in, um, we are much more international than we were and uh, uh, certainly the, uh, we see hydropower as a beneficial and a, a moderate energy source uh, where it's possible to, to actually produce or, to, or construct hydropower in a sustainable way. Uh, so we, we see it's, it's extremely important that we have a correct picture of uh, tentative greenhouse gas emissions. So uh, only then can we see if it's something that can be done about it, for instance, to mitigate it. If you don't have a correct understanding, if, if the, let's say, assumptions or accusations is based on tabloid, uh, chablon type of, uh, of uh, perceptions, then, then that will make this extremely difficult. It, it's tempting to say that it doesn't emit greenhouse gases. However, it can do. Uh, it is very important to, to take into regard that uh, hydropower is operating in what you call the short-term carbon cycle. So whatever comes out of a, a reservoir, it, and we're talking here not about life cycle emissions coming from constructing and cement and transportation, etc., but from the reservoirs. And what is coming up has first to be taken from the atmosphere and run through the plant life and, 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 and biota and then decomposing and going back. So it's a cycling of the same uh, number of, you could say, uh, molecules all the time. So you don't deliver any new carbon uh, atoms to the atmosphere. You don't, you're not, it's not possible with a, a, with a hydropower plant to actually increase uh, the, the, the concentration of greenhouse gases in the atmosphere. But what you can do is you can change what is called the radiative forcing by, uh, let's say, changing the chemical pathways. Uh, instead of going to carbon dioxide, you can have it go to methane. And then that's serious. So in that sense, you may uh, emit greenhouse gases. However, you need to know uh, what is due to nature and what is due to the man-made reservoir. extremely important that the uh, IHA really uh, has uh, uh, started work on this and has been doing so for a long time and continue to do this and that IHA is trying to see this to the end so that we actually get the tools we need to, to, to estimate this, this uh, problem actually or have an, this kind of quantitative, uh, let's say, grip on what is happening and that we are able actually to, to answer that we, when we are confronted by the media or uh, let's say a, a, a environmental group who, who don't like hydropower and accuses us of having greenhouse gases, then we should be able to answer uh, uh, and give the correct picture. And IHA is presently really uh, uh, doing a very good job on trying to come up with the uh, tools that can be used in this context.